Hello kids. Let's learn about taller and shorter. Taller and shorter. Meet Emma and her dad John. Let us compare the height of Emma and her dad. One of them is taller and the other is shorter. Height Height is the vertical distance from base to top. So, you can say that Emma's dad is taller and Emma is shorter. Okay. Now, in this picture, you have a tree next to John. If you look at the height of the tree and John, you can say that the tree is taller than John. In other words, John is shorter than the tree. When you compare heights, make sure they have the same starting point. Now, in this picture, you have a giraffe next to the tree. Which one do you think is taller and which one is shorter? Giraffe is taller than the tree. You are right. Giraffe is taller and the tree is shorter. In this picture, you have a building and a house. Which one do you think is taller and which one is shorter? Building is taller. Houses shorter. Yes, you are correct. Next, you have a stop sign and the house. Which one is shorter and which one is taller? Stop sign is shorter. House is taller. Great job! Next is a traffic signal and the stop sign. Which one is taller? Traffic signal is taller. Yes, you are right. Now, let me ask you a tricky question. Here, you have two trees. A mango tree and an apple tree. Which tree is taller and which one is shorter? Apple tree is taller than mango tree. You are right. The apple tree is taller than the mango tree. Here comes the tricky part. You have two ladders here. A red ladder and yellow ladder. So, if you need to pick some apples from the apple tree, which ladder would you choose? Red ladder. Red ladder is taller than yellow ladder. Yes, you are right. You need a tall ladder to pick apples from a tall apple tree. Now, let's play a fun dice game and let's build a short and tall towers. Here, you have a dice and some cubes. You have some yellow cubes and some purple cubes. Let's roll the dice two times for each color. Okay. Let's roll the dice. Dice shows the number 3. Okay, now let's stack three purple cubes one on top of the other. Let's roll the dice. Dice shows the number 2. Now let's stack two more cubes on top of the tower. You have a purple tower that is 5 cubes tall. Now let's build the yellow tower. Dice shows the number 6. Let's stack 6 cubes on top of the other. Let's roll the dice. Dice shows the number 4. Let's stack 
four more cubes on top of the tower. Now, can you tell me which tower is taller and which is shorter? Yellow? Yes, you are right. The yellow tower is 10 cubes tall. The purple one is 5 cubes tall. So, we can say that the yellow tower is taller than the purple tower. Next, let's learn how to measure heights. Let's measure. When you measure, you find out how tall the object is. At home, you can use objects like cubes, wooden blocks, erasers, paper clips, straws, Lego blocks, hand, feet, etc. for measuring heights. It is important that these units must be of the same size. Now let's measure this milk carton with some wooden blocks. Let's stack wooden blocks beside the milk carton until it reaches the same height. Please make sure that the blocks are of the same size. Now tell me how tall is it? Now you can say that the milk carton is 6 blocks tall. 6 blocks? Okay, let's measure the height of this cup using paper clips. The paper clips must be of the same size. Now tell me how tall is it? Four paper clips. This cup is four paper clips tall. Finally, let's measure the cereal box with some cubes. How tall is it? Six cubes. You did it. Great job. Please subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.